Hey everybody, you know, in this matter of sports team relocation, we get people who are a bit, a little bit, uh, just playing around with words and everything, and I guess maybe they have nothing better to do, and Robert Cole seems to be one of those people. Listen to this. He writes, in response, this is what he's responding to, okay? My tweet that reads, actually, since the ballpark draws... Many who would be new tourists in Las Vegas for baseball. It drives new revenue to MGM, Oyo, Hotel, Luxor, and other buildings next to the district. So it's still a win. And so anyway, um, anyway, uh, um, he says, he writes this. He has the temerity to actually write this. The ballpark isn't likely to draw people to Vegas. I repeat, the ballpark isn't likely to draw people to Vegas. He continues in his tweet, it might get people who would otherwise come here, plan their trip around a game, but the worst team in Major League Baseball isn't going to sell out every night. Replacing with the Tropicana would make more sense financially. <laughs> so, okay, let's see. Uh, a person who happens to be a fan of, say, oh, I don't know, um, the Tampa Bay team, the Devil Rays, or any pick any of the 30 Major League Baseball teams that would come. And from some areas that where the economics aren't so right for a person to want to go to Las Vegas to gamble as opposed to staying in their own area because you can now, and this is something that I want people to note, you can now, and this is a big deal, you can now drive an hour from your home to a casino anywhere in the United States you live. And where we are today is what Las Vegas Sands founder and president Sheldon Adelson was concerned about, the internet allowing people to gamble and the spread of gambling to be done closer to where they live as well as the electronic allowance of that and changes in law that would actually remove Las Vegas advantage. So Robert, writing, oh, they would come to Las Vegas anyway, is no longer necessarily the case because of how gambling has been disseminated. So again, we have another case of a person who just has to, and he does this a lot, respond to something that I write or say, but he doesn't think it through. <sighs> Subscribe to Zenny62 <laughs> and bookmark OaklandNewsNowBlog.com and Robert Keep them coming because I'll keep making money from them. Thank you.